The Buffalo Stabbing Festival, an intricate tapestry of the indigenous Montagnard Bunong culture. The Buffalo Stabbing Festival of the indigenous Montagnard Bunong is an extraordinary spectacle that draws audiences from across the globe. Far from a mere celebration, this sacred festival asserts the spiritual, cultural, and historical identity of this ethnic group, offering a glimpse into the soul of an ancient culture overlooked in the modern chronicles of Southeast Asian history. The day begins as the sun sprawls across the jade-tinted landscape of the Cambodian highlands, revealing the heart of the Montagnard Bunyong community, draped under a festive blanket. As the pre-dawn silhouettes transform into tangible figures, a pulsating energy fills the air. It's the day of the festival that the Bunong's respect and reverence for nature and their ancestral spirits is displayed through ritualistic depictions. Believed to be conduits between the physical and the spirit worlds, buffaloes play an integral role in the Montagnard Bunong culture. The species chosen for the sacrificial act are considered to contain the most potent life force. The stabbing ceremony symbolizes their release, allowing ancestral spirits to carry their spirits towards the heavens. The time-worn ritual commences with the convening of the Bunyong men around the buffalo. The creature is not restrained, but rather sedated by the sonorous chants breathed into the air by the rhythm of the sacred gong. As the revered shaman raises the traditional knife, the crowd falls into silence, the only sound being the whistling wind threading through the crowd and the distant echo of the gong. Through this rite, the Bunyong commune with nature in its purest, most primal form, the stabbing represents more than an act of sacrifice. It portrays the cyclic pattern of existence of life, death, and rebirth, mirroring the Bunong's belief system. It exemplifies the harmony they maintain with the terrestrial sphere, offering up a part of it to attain spiritual tranquility. But the Buffalo Stabbing Festival does not end with the buffalo's last breath. It merely transcends into the next phase. The buffalo's lifeless form becomes the centerpiece of a grand feast. This act reflects the community's principles of preservation and practicality. They extract every bit of sustenance from the buffalo, ensuring that its sacrifice is not in vain. Interwoven within the ritualistic proceedings is music the heartbeat of the festival. Bunong music, characterized by a symphony of gongs, drums, and unique ethnic instruments, underlines the proceedings, capturing the complex tapestry of emotions and spiritual undercurrents of the ceremony. Building the emotional crescendo with thunderous beats, Bunong music underscores the gravity of the sacrifice and reinforces the spiritual connection between the community, their ancestors, and nature. Their dances are equally mesmerizing, encapsulating the narratives of age-old traditions, ancestral wisdom, and their intimate bond with the vast Cambodian highlands they call home. The Buffalo Stabbing Festival culminates in a vibrant community gathering, underpinning their collective strength, unity, and shared cultural memory. It encompasses the Bunyong ethos of communal living and solidarity. After the buffalo's life force is released, the air seems lighter. There's a palpable sense of relief and exultation among the crowd, as the celebration transforms into a jubilant communal feast that echoes into the night. In conclusion, the Buffalo Stabbing Festival provides an intimate view of the Montagnard Bunyong people's unique socio-cultural and spiritual fabric. Despite its visceral nature, the festival serves as a testament to their survival, persistence, and resilience for centuries, enabling them to preserve their heritage against the backdrop of rapid globalization. As a commemoration of their past, a celebration of the present, and a prayer for their future, the festival symbolizes much more than a ritualistic interaction between the Montagnard Bunong community and its ethereal ancestors. It embodies a way of life that aligns with the rhythm of nature, appreciating and reciprocating its bounties in a cyclic dance revolving around life itself. It is a voice for a community that is equally a part of the grand human narrative, yet strikingly unique in its representation. It is indeed the heartbeat of the Montagnard Bunong people, resonating to their past, the present, and echoing into the future.